Plant cells are shaped by rigid walls. Osmotic forces press the plasma membrane against the cell wall, tightly filling the wall-formed box. The cell wall can be removed with enzymes. The remaining structure, a plant cell without walls or a plant protoplast, is now ordered by the plasma membrane. Since the shaping force of the wall is missing, the naked cell changes its shape. Isolated plant protoplasts are usually perfectly spherical in shape as a result of non-directional osmotic forces and a largely homogeneous elasticity of the plasma membrane. However, not all isolated plant protoplasts are spherical. Depending on the internal architecture, cytoplasmic strands may shorten and pull the membrane inwards, or they may lengthen and allow the protoplast to swell locally. Through cytoplasmic streaming, the strands continuously change their length, position, attachment, and branching, and as a result, the shape of the protoplast changes. Watch this dramatic motility in cells that are normally fixed in space. Laser microsurgery experiment provides proof that the inner tension built by the cytoplasmic network is moving the cell. A laser microbeam can enter the cell without inflicting damage to cellular structures that are not in the focal point or hot spot of the beam. Focusing at a cytoplasmic strand will cut the strand and cause the network to collapse. As a result, Osmotic forces can take over and round the protoplast. Moving around is not an option for most cells of higher plants, and cytoplasmic streaming serves normally the intracellular transport, but they have not totally lost the basic skills that would enable them to do it. 